here's the time. As you can see, we just left Hampton and he back up there. I, can probably, I don't know if I can see it all in looking into the camera. Wow, I guess I have five subways here. Look at that. Subway, 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 subway. Five subways. We're waiting to turn here on to US 20. There's a law enforcement ranger, park ranger. There's a uh, pilot over here. This RB's in the Cinnabon. Yeah, that little Cinnabon standing there. Look at that. Penske Cab YRC Freight. Whatever that is. Probably a shipping company. That's looking that way. It'll take you to Hill City, Fairfield, towards Sun Valley and Craters of the Moon. This is, we're about to go under Interstate 84. That way it takes you to Boise. That way it takes you to Twin Falls. And we're stuck behind a traverse. Oh, he's turning on the interstate. And let's let the camera roll as we're going down the street here. This is exit 95 from the Oregon border. So 95 miles that direction, you go to the Oregon border. There's Wendy's, McDonald's. Down there is the police station, that blue roof building, Pioneer Credit Union. And here is Auto Ranch location number one. Chrysler and Ford. Here's there's Walmart. And here's looking down in the town. We're on American Legion now. That's what it turned into back up to 95. <coughs> Sorry, we have the windows down, so there's probably a lot of wind in the mic. I apologize. But this will be rolling down American Legion Boulevard here in Mountain Home, Idaho. Looks like we're stuck behind a Lexus. Thank you. It's 35. There goes the GMC. As you can see, really nothing to see much. There's Doctor's Clinic, Desert Sage, Mon Homarvi Park. That used to be what they called the Golden Crown. And now it's called Red Pavilion. It's, it was, used to be good, but now it just doesn't agree with me anymore. It's Pennzoil. There's a canine unit back there. second I'll give you a good view of our church that I go that we go to there's our church back there behind Sears so this Sears is sadly losing business every single day it's because they really don't have enough people that come there and plus Sears in general is going out of business and here's that canine unit right next to us and he's gonna turn in front of us there's a car wash. And this will be 10th Street and Maverick. Maverick's off to the left. And that old building off across the street is the old high school, which is now Bennett Mountain High School, which is an alternative school. And behind that is Hacker Middle School. And we're stuck in traffic. Well, then again, school just let out, so... That's uh, most likely the case. Um, police unit just got back behind us. There's Carl Miller Park. There's an F-15. This is one of the... I think this is the second biggest park here in Mountain Home. And we're going to go down... Looks like we're going to go down Hacker, right? This is Hacker over here. Give you there's the gym and the cafeteria. And here we go. Here's a bunch of school buses picking up all the kiddos from school. 
All the kiddos. And that. Oh, that scared me. Where's Shorty? Is that? That's the truck you towed the Luna on. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. And there's Karen and Bud's house. Yep. This is, I forgot street. This is, here's a street sign. Fourth. Fourth. And we're on second, east, second, north. And we'll be turning down 4th Street, north, 4th, east. As we go by, so you can hear all these kids here at Hacker. Yeah, I can hear them all. There's the Elmore County Courthouse. Off that big building right there. And of course, we can't film the elevator there because it's a federal building. So... They're definitely going to say no to filming county. a county building, so they're definitely going to say no to that. Reach your security, Justin. Yeah. <clears throat> and I'll be turning right onto Jackson Street. There's the street sign, there's Jackson. And of course, these streets are busy this time of day during the week, days, because of how big these things are. And busy. Yeah. They're turning on the north or east. It heads train tracks, there's downtown, that direction. Okay, we got about an hour before I gotta go get the mail done. And I gotta go get. I gotta go to Albertsons and get a dollar, a couple dollars, to fix it. So. And here we go. There's Napa. There's the old Paul's Market that went out of business. Thank you, Albertsons. Um, here's the museum, which I've never been to, even though I've been living here for almost 15 years. It's sad. You go, you live in your hometown. You haven't been to the museum. It's pretty sad. Just going down the street here. There's a hunting dog. Hmm. Pretty quiet neighborhood for the most part. Probably until a train comes flying through town. Then it's not so quiet. Yeah, it's one thing that all people live here mountain home have to deal with. And here's an old ore cart, here on someone's front yard. Look at that, an old ore cart, sitting right there in their front yard. And it'll be turning right on to South 6th East. Yeah, the way they divide up these streets here in the town is just absolutely weird. American Legion divides North and South, same with the Air Base Road, and then Main Street divides east and west, so that's our how it's gridded. There's a tanker off to the little, off to the, right there in front of us, and here we are at the train tracks. Which I'm gonna go and pause the video so I can save space. So if you see a train, I'll start another video. But for now, that will be it. <laughs> 